In Hillsborough County tonight, a woman attacked by a dog, and now a Tampa neighborhood is on the defense as people living in this Riverside Heights community say dogs are terrorizing just about everyone there. And we've just learned the owner of one of those dogs has been cited. ABC Action News reporter Cameron Pullum is taking action tonight and has the latest. This is ridiculous. A quiet neighborhood on edge. Cell phone video showing a pack of dogs, big and small, running the streets of this Tampa neighborhood all seemingly coming from a single home. Chasing people walking their dogs, chasing people by themselves, growling. One video showing just that, a person walking their dog on a leash is forced to swat away the animal. I had my hands full, and I started walking up the sidewalk to go into the front door, and they were following me, growling and barking. Kelly Chung got an up-close and personal view of the chaos Wednesday while unloading groceries. I was just trying to back up. When I turned to open the door, one of them just jumped up and bit the back of my leg. Her injury severe enough for a trip to the hospital. The blood was everywhere. I'm hysterical. My little dog, I have a 12-pound mini Dotson. She was trying to get out to get to them. We moved here almost three years ago, and in that three years, We've had problems with them for probably two. Tara Partridge says she's personally reported the owners on a number of occasions. No one was home when we went to the home, but the holes in the fence were still there. Hillsborough Animal Services has confirmed the owner was given a citation and the dog who attacked is under home quarantine. However, neighbors aren't sure that's enough and believe it all could have been prevented. I know they've patched holes in fences and things like that, but the dogs keep getting out and and not only are the dogs getting out, but they're aggressive dogs getting out. I talked to one of my neighbors this morning. He said, I hate to say it, but you took one for the team. <laughs> I'm just grateful it wasn't my child. In Tampa, I'm Cameron Polam, ABC Action News.